Eric and I wanted to show you how to play a solo in the style of Kirk Hammett. The solo is in the key of A, so our first finger is here, at the 17th fret of the first string. So we put a minor one pentatonic right around it, and that's what the first portion is based on. We're going to be bending up from the second string to the first string, like with full steps. And then we go to the third string like that. Uh, so the entire run, nice and slow. A little quicker. Then we walk up to the root, and then we do a descending sequence starting with two pull offs. Very similar phrase here two pull offs. fifth of the scale, so a little quicker that particular one. And one more time. Okay, then we go down to the low G, and we're going to walk right up into position and do another minor one pentatonic. Okay. So the way that we walk up to it is... So it starts off with a hammer on from G to A. And that's a quick shift right there. So, so continuing that particular run. And the ending there, we just add it on the ninth of the scale. And uh, just it just wraps up you know the tail end of that particular run. So the whole row, one more time. A little faster. Okay, to complete our solo, what we're going to do is another hammer-on pull-off, and we're going to use the E string as a pedal. So, do a hammer-on, pull-off, and then just do a down-up on the E string. So a little quicker that particular run over and over would be. Then we're going to walk it up the neck, ending on E. So we're going to walk up half steps here. So a little faster. And full tempo. One other thing that you can do with the techniques you learn in the solo is you can make an exercise combining the descending sequence and the ascending sequence. So we start off with the descent. Just end right there on the third fret of the fifth string. And then ascend starting on G just like we did in the solo. Do it again. Alright, have fun with that.